A long-standing tradition in Price Hill almost came to a standstill. They called this morning and said we have a problem. In the final hours, organizers found out more help would be needed to ensure a safe event. That problem? Cincinnati police told parade organizers they would need 47 more volunteers to step up. So folks quickly turned to social media. Price Hill answered the call. Uh, I love our community. I, I knew that they would if, if we told them there was a problem. Uh, that they would come through and they have. And so they saved the parade. They're going to be an awful lot of happy children. 47 people stepped in exactly what they needed. The thought that it was going to be canceled because of a lack of volunteers was really disturbing. People like Sheila Rosenthal. The fact that we missed it last year was it was it was really sad, but um, it's really important uh, to the community that we we start coming back together as as a community. And so we were excited to see the parade happening again. She'll help move barricades to close down streets bright and early. It was a, a really great feat to be able to pull that many people together to step into the, the breach and, and uh, take care of the safety issues that were involved in now we can have our parade and it's going to be a great day. An annual celebration with a bit more to be thankful for this year. I wasn't sure if we were going to be able to make it, but I'm really proud of, of my neighbors and friends who stepped up to uh, make this happen. The parade starts at 10 a.m. here at Western Hills High School and goes to the St. Lawrence Center. We'll put more information on WCPO.com.